Hello everybody, what's going on? Slumming so back here for the second map of the three-part adventure of Archaic. And this one is called The Foretold Prophecy of the Ancient Power. If you haven't checked out my first Let's Play of the first map, I would suggest going to do so, so you know what's going on here in the second map, obviously. The first map was a lot of fun, and hopefully this one will be just as good, and now we're going to figure out what happened with Silas Motto. Once again, step on freshman to this one to get value information about the area you're in. Also, remember the gold nuggets and gold ingots are currency in this area of Arcade. Likewise, some of your items from the last map may have been scattered. Lastly, remember that you will receive some of the objectives in the, the temple. And we're starting out with a little bit less of a year to date. We're in the jungle, so you gotta, gotta keep cool. The timekeeper's key is back. Basically, use the sword. You were in the land of the unwanted. Now you are in the unfamithable jungle. This area is riddled with tons of Lyro's troops. He is taking over the area, most likely hiding somewhere or keeping something safe. There is war amongst the gods starting, and time is running out to keep them from destroying the world. Ignis should have helped you fight, but she may be too upset at the moment. There is also a temple. The temple has been has been guarding a prophecy as well as something that could save the world, which the prophecy may contain details about. The only issue is how many people are going to how many people are going to try to stop you, and how far will they go to succeed? It all lies in one person yet again, Silas Morrow. How does he tie into the rest of the mystery? What has he done to protect the biggest secrets of Archaic? Could he truly be a lot? Resets, play in survival mode and normal. No hacks, no cheats, no fans. Who's behind on random boxes? Play single day. Um, gold objectives are mandatory, silver objectives are optional. Crypt team includes specific gold pressure plates, helping chests, and start on the spawn. Map creator Josh underscore nine eight seven six five. Thanks everyone, and this map is And we have the first clue. Myler has stationed guards and other evil beings everywhere. He is guarding something. Something that could stop him from destroying Ignis if he could actually win that is. So the first clue is in our hand. Can you just here? It's playing on 1.8. So that's the boat launch and the fishing platform is out over this way. Droopy Vine Pass. Begin our mission. Half dry spring. Even though inhabitants of this area are of archaic get lost of their water from lakes and streams, this well has always been a backup. Even though it is far away, it is the cleanest water for miles. Silas must have hidden parts of the temple in areas of the land of the unwanted and here in the unfemitable jungle. Why does this happen with the clues? I don't know. Secrets secrets lying beyond beyond wander. We stick to the path. Should we go off on our own and explore? The world may never know. This wicked jungle. Well, oh, there's a green light over there. That's always a good sign, too. It's probably a temple. So this is going to be like the last map where I have to like collect the blocks and then... Make them together. I'm not sure. I'm just going to follow the path. It's a victory. Droopy Vine Pass and uh, Ethukal and Junglewood Lake. Oh, this is where Ethukal is. Okay, that's cool. We got mobs. Not you guys again. Not you guys again. Those were so hard to beat last time. Welcome to Ithugo. Hello. Hello. This is a small town with Ithugo. The people here are really enjoying where they live. Except temple nearby neighborhood section. And we're going to go over here. 
Oh, those come back and the stalls are closing. Hello? Hello? Hmm. So you got weapons and stuff. The fruit seller is taken by Lyra last night. He's gone and well, we're out of food. Great. Great, 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 great. I would really appreciate food right at the moment. That's not in my knees right now. That's not in my knees right now. You guys have food. There's no food. We're out of food. This isn't good. It's a lead. More gold nuggets. Thukul's neighborhood. Most of the Thukul residents live in this area. Lots of time they have to go on high alert because of the mobs. Well, that's not a good sign. Other pants. More gold nuggets, which is nice. Sorry if I'm looting your uh, town, people. I'm uh, in need of some uh, things. Arrows are nice. Ancient glass shard. Don't know what that does, but we have it now. Um, golden sword is the same as that. It's not really gonna do much. Might have to take rotten flesh to eat because we don't have anything else to eat. Follow the path. Healing sphere, fishing rod, clock. Well, I kind of want to keep going on the path, but I don't. But is this the end of the path? The end of the path. It's the end of the path, and we're good. Just like it is. I don't see anything else of value around. Alright, so we'll go back to the main area here. And see what's going on with the people of the town. Public residence. More of that. The boat might come in handy. I don't know the boats. Apples. Thank you. Second key of the timekeeper. Oh, it's one of the keys. Okay. I want my glass shards back. They predate the first timekeeper. Of course, there are no timekeepers anymore because not many people care about magic. The last timekeeper stayed in the clock tower in the land of the unwanted. I have been researching the timekeepers all my life. Not much is known about them. I need to the glass shards to help me awaken the ancient power. Apparently the first timekeeper hid something away in the temple of the unbirth. It needs to be awakened. The ancient power can solve all of your issues. The first timekeeper must have seen unrest in this time strand. Now it is time. Nobody in my village can know. I want to save the world. Also, if anyone else is trying to awaken the power, things could get ugly. So we need the shards, and we need the keeper, the timekeeper stuff. Hey, there's the enchantment table. We got some food in our belly here. This is the storage house. Thank you, storage. I'm... Shark in the, uh... Oh, food, food, glorious food. Oh, how I want to eat you. Food, glorious food. How I want to try it. Food, glorious food. Put all the shards and important stuff in the chest in case I die because there's lots of mobs around here. This is another residence with enchantments, and I need that sword. Residents of the Gaunt family. Now the hunted by sadness forever must be of the missing daughter. Seem familiar? No, it does not. Um, we got another book. Get more shards, which is nice. <clears throat> Where did my daughter go? I have been trying to help her. 
Before she mysteriously disappeared, she seemed sad and depressed. What's going on? Why can't Maurice be here right now? I miss her with all my heart. We had a bond, a bond that has now been broken. Maurice goes missing, and then there is this whole issue with Lyro. What is happening to this world? I don't know. I don't know, good sir. I really don't know. But we will find out. Who in the world needs jungle bees? We might be able to trade with these guys right now. Um, I don't know if you have anything I need right now. Um, I don't know you need there either. You. now. Oh, we didn't use any potions last game, so I don't think I'm going to really need them now. Uh, which one do you use the weapon? Diamond sword in hand. Bow. Looking fine dandy right now. Completed three of the objectives. Now, like we can go back to the start because there was another direction you can go from the beginning. And we'll see where that takes us. That wasn't so hard to follow. The lines are just fine. Keep running. I don't want to mess with them. There's actually two more ways. A bunch more ways. Oh man, there's more ways. Oh, let's go with the boat launch. Hey, hey. Speedy Gonzales! Speedy Gonzales! Speedy Gonzales! Speedy Gonzales! Tier 3 Earth Guardians. Huh. <laughs> Get out of here. Tier 3 Earth Guardians coming after me and killing me. Sweet Jeepers. Uh, another book. More things. Shards. Nice. Stuff, good stuff, good. I'm Miles Zoowather. I built this little fishing lodge because it gets crowded in your ethical th sometimes. Now it is hard to visit regularly with all this evil going on. It is hard for me to scavenge for fruits. I feel like I can get kidnapped. So much for trying to find peace and harmony in nature. I know. I understand your pain. It's, it's tough times right now, but you must push forward in life. Here. 
And evil has come here. Stay out, the chief. Appreciate the food. Coming in handy. Splash potion. Didn't even need to buy the thing. More arrows. Seeds. Rabbit hide. What's going on? Yeah.